Hey everyone, this is Dr. Ryan Ball from Prosper Health Clinics continuing the testosterone series. So we've already done pituitary gland, we've done cortisol. Now we're looking at sex hormone binding globulin and that is produced by the liver. So does the liver actually affect um, what is going on with your testosterone? Yes, so if you do a spit test, let's say you go to the, let's, let's say they actually are trying to figure out your hormone levels are doing good testing on you and they're gonna do a spit test on you. And that, let's say that that shows way low. Well, spit tests are only free fraction. They don't go over anything that's bound to sex hormone binding globulin or any other binding globulin. And so what'll happen is that's low, but if we did a blood, it might be higher up. And in that situation where you have low free fraction and normal or, or, or even raised or slightly lower uh, blood levels, we know that sex hormone binding globulin is in play and we need to go ahead and support the liver function. Be sure that you're looking at liver function if you're a low testosterone patient. And I'm Dr. Ryan Ball from Prosper Health Clinics and have a great day.